So guys, welcome back to Season 2 of the Southampton career mode. As you can see, I'm gonna accept the preseason tournament here. I want some extra money. I'm gonna go with... Who is the easiest? I wanna go with this one, 9 million, because I'm just gonna sim through all the, the games and focus on players I wanna get instead. So as, as you can see here, I have, as you guys can see here, they, these are the players I want to sign as of right now. Uh, Adnan Janusai, I want to sign him, he costs 28 million, that's a lot of money. I want to sign Hongmin Sun, I will inquire about him right away. Only 15 million, he's 23. And like 73 or 4 overall. I have not made any... Uh, inquiries about more money. These, are, this is the money they give gave me right away. Forty million. They gave me forty million to spend on players, and I'm gonna inquire about uh, Hong Min Sun and Al Sharawi. We can't afford Samuel Um Titi. We can't afford Yanusai. We can afford though. But do I really want to sign him for that a lot of money? He's 21 and he's a real beast. So he has a lot of potential. So I hope we can sign him. And I'm going to look for some players I'm going to sell here. As you can see, this is the squad. It looks pretty much the same from the last season. Davis is going to leave. So we need to find... Uh, Currently, a new, uh, a new CM for us. We have Shane Long. I'm looking to sell Shane Long, I think. And we have pretty much not a single one who can play for us. Instead for instead for uh, Davies as of right now. So maybe Rodriguez. He's 26, so he can play uh, for us. Junami can play, he's 23 years old, 73 overall. He can play for us, so maybe I won't sign a new CM. Maybe I want to sign a new, uh, I want to sign a new right back and maybe a backup for, now we don't need a backup for uh, Augustine, so we have uh, Bertrand. James Ward James Ward Prowse is 21, 77 overall. I'm not looking to sell him. He's a beast of a player who was really important the last season. I have inquired about a right back or a new left back actually. It's Wendell or Wendell. He's 22 years old, 80 overall. He costs a lot of money. Maybe we can get it down to like 25. And we get a transfer offer here guys for our big huge signing for the last season. Luis Muriel is 25 years old, 78 overall. I'm not gonna sell him. That's Burnley as well. Burnley wanted the uh, Butlin as well. So no thank you Burnley. And Saint at the end want Luis Muriel. I'm not gonna give give them Luis Muriel. They only offered 10.5, I think is worth a lot more let's see here Wendell has accepted or they have accepted a Wendell deal here so let's just skip this it's a 3-0 win Ward Prowse, Ramirez and Mane got the goal they missed the penalty that's good and we get a lot of contracts here or uh, offers here for players no not offers really yeah we get an offer for Fraser Forster uh, kind of want 4.3 for him 4.3 for uh, Fraser Foster I think they will accept that uh, Wendell don't wanna don't wanna sign for us he wants 90 so I'm gonna give him 90 an important player for four years let's see Hungmin Son accepts he wants 
Oh, I mean, he accepts, so we can sign him. I'm gonna sign him right away, actually. So, Hyungmin Sun accepts. And one new player, guys. Finally, we got a new player. And I also inquired about uh, Tyus Browning here. A center back from uh, Everton. He's only 22 years old. I'm actually gonna offer 2.4 because that's really nothing. So guys, we have a match against Lokomotiv here. We should really win this easy, I think. They won their game against Zenit with 2-1. And Hyungmin Sun is gonna make his debut for us in this game. Hope he can get a goal. We win by 3-1. Ramirez got two, Mane got one. Ramirez scored a penalty. That's good. Yeah, that's a comfortable win. We are on six points right now, I think, in the preseason tournament. Yeah, we are first by six points, so we shouldn't really drop this. If we get one point more, then we will uh, go through. So guys, Everton has accepted Tyus Browning's deal here. He wants only 25,000 for four years. I'm gonna give it to him. And I'm gonna give him... Can I give him squad rotation player? I hope we can. If we can give him squad rotation player, that would be great. But I still wanna sign Wendell though. So let's give him... 90 and let's give him crucial then I'm gonna make him disappointed but or maybe I can play maybe I can do like this I play Augustinson on the bench and Wendell on the left back there and uh, Augustinson will be our like uh, squad rotation player that would be kinda good uh, the offer there, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna accept this. 4.1, that's good. That's actually pretty good for Forster there. Another offer now from Leicester City on Ward Prowse. I'm not gonna sell Ward Prowse. I won't. He's <laughs> another from PSG on 14.5 million. No. And Wendell has accepted. I'm gonna accept the deal. Wendell, welcome to the club. 22 years old, 80 overall. And Tyus Browning is accepted, so we're gonna sign him up as well. We are only on 16 million left though. So we are gonna jump into the semi-final here and just sim it through. Let's see if we can get a win or if we lose, I think we will win. No, we lose! Carlos Tevez with the only goal and we are out of uh, the preseason tournament, guys. That's not good. How did that even happen? And we're gonna play the Community Shield against Chelsea in the final. That's interesting. And we get another offer here for a player I really wanna sell. Cuco Martina. I don't wanna keep him, so bye bye. S 70 or overall and 26 years old. We have no reason to keep him whatsoever. World Cup. We're gonna keep those, so. So, guys, I have inquired about two right backs here. Uh, Felix Paslak is one of them. He's 18 years old. He he can be a future player for us. Cause I wanna f have uh, like a decent like a decent uh, option for Cedric. Cause I don't think Cedric will, can play every single game. He will be so tired. So I'm looking to sign Fel Felix Paslak here. And I have. One more player as well. Kenny Tete, I want to sign him. They are not, they do not want us or sell him. So I'm gonna offer like 8 million. See if they accept. Because I know Kenny Tete is a really good player. He's a solid player in real life as well. But he recently joined another team. So that's not good for us. So, guys, I'm gonna end the episode with some training here the episode is getting really long and we are gonna have uh, Browning are gonna I think he will go up to 71 
After this training ses session, we are going to train Augustinsson in 1 on 2 defending and distance shooting. And El Rondo on Riddleveld. So let's sim this and then end the episode. Let's see if we can get some growth. Oh, that's not bad. He fails El Rondo. Really? Browning? Come on. But Augustinsson went up to 73. That's really good. And Riddleveld failed El Rondo as well. Dude, what's going on with my left or with my center backs? But yeah, guys, that's gonna be the end of the episode. So. I'm sorry we didn't play anything this game, there will be games in the next episode. I'm not gonna sign any more players, maybe sell some players. So leave a like, comment down below what you think about the three new signings we have signed up. Almost four maybe, it can be four players. This is our strongest team as of right now, so we have Butler in the goal, Wendell on the left, Font and Ridwell in the middle. Of the defense, there's Cedric on the right, one Jam on the CDM, Warprows and Youngmin Sun on the CM spots, and Ramirez on the cam, and Mane and Muriel at striker as usual. So, this can be the starting lineup. Comment down below if you think there is something I can change here, like maybe take out. Uh, Mane put in Shane Long or put in or take off Muriel and take him in Shane Long or play like uh, Rodriguez, Stadich, Reed, anyone maybe Kalgren in goal instead for Butland but yeah that's gonna be our strongest team in my opinion but comment down below what you guys think and we signed three new players in this episode so I will see you guys in another video subscribe for my other videos as well and I will see you guys later. Bye!